this morning. They just told us about a warm up coming this weekend. Yeah, but there are definitely some businesses who are still trying to recover from all of this cold that we've been seeing. Yeah, CBS 42 News reporter Connie Gasky caught up with some of those businesses. Connie? Yeah, I spoke to the owner of a coffee shop in Sylacauga. She had to shut down her shop for about a day and a half because of all this snow and ice that we've been dealing with over the course of this week. The name of that shop is Heavenly Grounds. It's located there in downtown Sylacauga. They had some ice that was outside right beside their shop. They had to shut down early Tuesday, missed a full day Wednesday, opened late yesterday. They're a small town, local business, so shutting down like this is very tough. The owner is already having to think ahead for ways to recover these losses. Okay, well, next week we might need to like revamp some social media, you know, to pull people in, you know, like post different things to try to, you know, give them an idea. Oh, yeah, well, we need to go there. And it's also tough deciding how to handle snow. She says she probably shut down a little bit too early on Tuesday, but that was just a matter of making sure that all her employees were safe. And she summed this up pretty well in a way that I think a lot of us can relate to. She said, We are over the snow here in the South. Live on the deck, Cotton Gasquay, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.